You could say I dibble and dabble in playing Overwatch. Come here, bitch. Ah! Ah! And as I was playing Overwatch, I came up with a groundbreaking discovery. Moira needs a Gojo skin. But you guys have to hear me out, okay? I'm not just talking crazy. This is actually a good idea. Maybe. You crying? Now, to all the people that love Gojo, they're gonna be like, why am I gonna add my six foot tall, blue eyed, white hair, glorious king as Moira? But hear me out once again. First off, Gojo and Moira, they low key have the same build. I just searched this up, but can you believe that Moira is six foot five? Six foot five! What is she doing in Overwatch? She, she needs to go catch herself some buckets. I really don't know how Moira is that tall. She's Irish too, so like, what type of lucky charms is she eating? Either way, Moira is actually taller than Gojo. Gojo is six foot three. Now, some of you guys may be thinking, two inches is a lot. Like, a lot, a lot. But in height, no. So they're basically the exact same height. That's kind of small. They already looked like they had the same build anyway. Just really tall and really lanky. And Gojo and Moira looking alike is really all you really need for a collab in Overwatch. Cause when you look at Soldier 76 and Moomin Rider, what do they have in common besides their look and stature? If Moomin Rider had a gun, I think he might've at least been able to stand a chance against that ugly ass swamp monster. Now, when we look at Saitama and Doomfist, they don't really share the same body type like at all, but they share the premise of punching. So. You really have two guidelines of getting an Overwatch collab, being the same body type or sharing the same premise. And what if I told you Gojo has the body type, which we already checked, but also the premise. So when we take a look at all of Moira's abilities, we have Biotic Grasp, Biotic Orb, Fade, and Coalescence. Co Coalescence, yeah. And these are low key, just cookie cutter abilities of Gojo's. So, out of all her abilities, we can start with the orb. We have a positive charged orb and a negative charged orb. Does that ring any bells? Positive cursed energy, negative cursed energy. So, Moira's healing orb is basically just Gojo's reverse curse technique orb. And then her damage orb is basically just a lapsed blue. Now, moving on to her next ability, which is Fade. The description of Fade is disappear, move faster, and become invulnerable. If this sounds like any of Gojo's abilities, it's definitely teleportation. There's some speculation on how Gojo teleports, but they say it's a part of his infinity technique and he just chooses the stretchingness of time and space and things like that of that nature, yeah. Either way, that's really close to fade and it matches up really well. With Gojo's teleport, you can really just change like the purple aura thing that Moira has to blue and it would work out perfectly fine. And now we move on to the ult, the thing that planted the seed in my mind that I should make this a video. The coal, coalescence, coal, hold up. Coalescence. Coalescence. Yes, it's, it's coalescence. I don't, I don't know why I was struggling with that so hard. But coalescence, tell me this ult is not just hollow purple. The ult is literally combining your positive energy, your negative energy, and then you're just pushing it out all at once. If that's not hollow purple, I don't know what is. It would look so cool too. It could be like just a beam of purple, or it could be like a little bit of blue, a little bit of red, and then just like purple at the end or something. There's many ways they could go about this. But if I was a dev at Overwatch, this is how I would adapt Moira as Gojo. For the build, they're literally like the exact same. So I wouldn't really have to do much changing there, except the outfit and the face and the hair color, you know, all that type of stuff. You can keep the face thing she has if you want, but personally, I wouldn't give them a little Gojo glasses or just no glasses. And then for the abilities, for the orb, just change the colors. So the negative energy, which is gonna be technically the healing energy, we're gonna have the healing orb be red, and then we're gonna have the damage orb be blue. And then looking at the teleport, we're gonna keep it the exact same, except just change the color, as I said earlier. And then the ult, there's multiple ways to go about this. The two main ways I have is either just the purple beam with like red and blue, or just a straight purple beam, or there could be like this one thing that I saw in like a TikTok filter. <laughs> now, the TikTok filter is actually kind of tough, okay? So what it is, is like, there's a Gojo that's trying to like beat a bunch of people and you have to tap really fast and he like shoots out a bunch of like little hollow purples and stuff. So the ult could kind of just be like a bunch of mini hollow purples being shot out like orbs, but I don't know if they want 
to develop that and i don't know if that would like crash a bunch of people's games or if it would even look good in general but options are options and the only part of moro's kit that doesn't really fit gojo's abilities would be moro's normal attack and her healing i don't really have any solutions to this besides just changing the color so her damage would be blue and then her healing would be like red gas we can just act like gojo just has sucking abilities and can heal people like shoko and with that i think i perfectly cooked up why gojo should definitely be more in overwatch i want you guys to let me know what you guys think about this and if you think i cooked up because i personally i i don't even i don't even think i know i cooked up either way who knows maybe one day you'll log on to overwatch and then more is a gojo skin it might take days weeks months years but one day you'll hop onto overwatch and you'll see gojo satoro as a Moira skin. Maybe. Wait, what? She said she was it's raised violence. by wolves. Yeah, out in a box. Are you like, are you like Shark Boy? Yeah, just a little you less hell? cool. Yeah, give us a hell. Oh! <laughs> that shit was yeah, never weak. do that again. That shit was weak. You gotta be like, HOW! <laughs> what? Who the just barked like that? <laughs> Hold up, is that the old outro? Yes, sir.